What is up, Phantoms? Extreme Phantom back with another video. Today, we are back with another episode of the podcast on the channel. Um, today, we, we're, we're finally back. So, um, with all of that being said, uh, I think we could, should kind of just jump right into it. Um, hopefully, these are going to get more consistent as we go on. But enough of me rambling let's jump in or let me undefin the boys from the call and yeah so banana peppers cardboard <laughs> shorts oh <laughs> hey what's going on board shorts I, board shorts i i undefin you to banana peppers yeah see it's great i feel like you were just saying random stuff just the entire oh yeah time. Yep, you're calling out. To be, to be fair, we were actually trying to plan it out, and you uh, kind of like back at the most inopportune time. Uh, that's okay. <laughs> okay, so um, I mean, we we got Tyler here, who who's here for every episode. Yeah. <laughs> um, Jerry isn't in the call right now. He he's MIA right now. Um, but give a warm welcome, um, to my friend Eternal. Yo. <laughs> Yo. Yo. What up? Um, so it do you wanna kinda just give a rundown of uh kind of stuff you do in the community, I guess. The stuff that I do, what do I not do? Good <laughs> lord. Not I was about to say you do a lot of things. I, oh man, like you know, I it's dad. been it's yeah, that's that's a big one, but uh, it has also been reported that I have a wall of like 40 monitors so I can keep track of all of my crazy kids too. Uh, that's not the case. It's only 20. Um, <laughs> mm. <laughs> Man has to minimalize every now and then and just kind of do that. But basically, uh, crazy journey for me started a long time ago back in the uh, murder basement days of Dylan. I don't know if any of you guys remember that at all, but... I found him randomly through like a uh, a recommendation on YouTube because I frequented YouTube a lot, and then all of a sudden from there it branched out and I found uh, Ryan and Frank and Vinny and Dobbs and the whole crew, and uh, I just became like super involved in the community and that was that's the, that's the story, man. That's it. It's, it's the story. <laughs> it's the story. Yeah. See, see, my first um, kind of, I guess. Well, what's the word I'm looking for? Like, uh, oh my god, the word's right there. Like um, general interaction with yeah, the community? Yeah, yeah, that. With, with like, this whole group, uh, I think was either, I think it was Ryan, because I was actually a part of his first thousand. Um, And then I think that branched off into Vinny, and then Frank, and then the rest of them. And it's just weird to think about it it's it's weird how you just see them grow oh it's nuts uh like i said you know dylan started in a basement in his sister's mm -hmm. store and now and now the man just bought a house dude i'm so happy for them oh, so man. yeah and and this this weekend and what not tomorrow He's having his first ever sleep lock in the new house to celebrate. So that's that's amazing to me right there. Yeah. You know, to see him going from the basement to his first apartment, then from his apartment to a house, then to the house to an actual, actual, actual own it house. You know, it's <laughs> it's like it no, it, it it's truly amazing. You know, it's it's really awesome and inspiring to be a part of a community where growth is promoted like this. It's nuts. Mm -hmm. Yeah, and um We'll get into the normal anime and stuff, but we kind of just wanted to kind of give you guys a rundown of kind of the stuff that, I guess, um, about the community, I guess. Mm. <laughs> um, but yeah, uh, Tyler, you got anything before we jump right in? I got nothing. I mean, I started out with, um, it's funny that you guys mentioned that you start, started with like Dylan and Ryan, but I actually started out with Vinny. And it translated to everybody else. Oh, okay. So it's kind of like a different, like where I started out in the community. It's a little bit different, but it's not 
ridiculously different. So. Okay, you want to know what would be really funny? What would be funny? If Jerry started out with Asteroid. Yo, that would be hilarious. That'd be funny. <laughs> um, I was going to say that would be uh, that would be some uh, representation, wouldn't it? Yeah, that'd be actually kind of that'd be kind of interesting. <laughs> um, so with that being said, let's jump right in. Um, do you guys want to start with anime news or gaming news? Well, we are gamers. <laughs> gamers. Hey. gamers. Okay, so yeah, I guess we'll start with the gaming this week. Um, so the first thing on my list, you guys probably know because of Pokemon Sword and Shield. We got surfetched this week. No. The, yes, we did. Um, and and if you guys haven't seen uh, surfetched, uh, let me just plop a picture on the screen for you. So uh, I don't know how you wouldn't have seen him, but stranger things have happened. He's magnificent. That is all. Um, honestly, I really like the way this man looks. So. Uh, honestly, he might be on my team. I, uh, I love the fact that he's just, uh, smug AF. <laughs> look, that. look at the face. Honestly, Dude. it's all in the face. He's, like, got that squinty-eyed look, that smug little smile. He's looking at you sideways, like, yo. Um. Yeah. I'm gonna be honest. He looks like me if I was an England guard. It that is, is all. <laughs> I like how Tyler just ends everything. That is all. That is all. <laughs> no, no further comments at this time. That's it. Uh, I have to say, I, I'm enjoying. Uh, I know we've only got three currently at the moment, but I'm enjoying all of the uh, the newer Galar region mons that we have yes. so far. Like the whole Obstagoon thing. Uh, that, that's honestly really cool. The Galarian. Don't get me started on the Galarian form of Weezing. That's just dude, awesome. Dude, it's Doug Dimodome, owner of it is. Dale Dimodome. How could you ever go wrong with a top hat and a mustache made of smog and just toxic material? Tr- true. Seriously. Um, what more do you want in your life? And then, of course, now you've got Surfetch, the. Uh, yeah. Oversized uh, leak wielding evolution of <laughs> after twenty years, Farfetch'd finally gets an evolution. Finally, finally. See, and uh, it's a sword exclusive too, so that makes yeah. me happy. Sword, sword was always going to be my first one. I'm getting both, but sword was always going to be my first playthrough. See, I I have so many um, mons that I want to have on my team, but I'm not sure like who I'm gonna like make sure is on my team surfetched might be up there though um because i i know i'm putting yamper and corviknight on my team hey corviknight and, and maybe dreadnought um but yeah there's there's a lot of cool mons that the Galar region is bringing in um not showing any love for the uh, possessed teacup see I wasn't a fan. I wasn't a fan. I mean, it, it's... what's the name? Pol- Poltegeist? Yeah, Poltegeist. Yeah, Poltegeist. Oh my god. Luigi's weapon in Luigi's Mansion, man. <laughs> You're, uh... it's, it's Luigi's Mansion's Pokemon. <laughs> You're grasping a straws game freak. Poltegeist? <laughs> you really gotta do it to us like that, eh? <laughs> Someone, I, I think it was on Twitter. Um, Somebody, like, legitimately, um, like um I, what's the word like guessed the exact name and everything of this mm-hmm. like two years ago oh yeah there's um, a big there's a big leak out there right now that yeah. so far has <laughs> has 100 percent identified everything that they've announced yeah what what the yeah, heck yeah. Yeah. yeah no it's it's all been true so far because i first <laughs> It's hilarious because I first read this leak and I was like, there's no way that all of this stuff is going to make it into this game. It sounds so uh, ridiculous and left a field that it's just not a possibility. And then every single announcement, every single announcement that they have made up to this very day has come true. And I'm like, well, here we are. This is the world we live in. I have no comment. No, I, I don't either. I'm, I'm legitimately scared for if some of this other stuff is going to be true. <laughs> Hold on. Is it the 
I, I think I found it. Is it the one that it shows? Um, God dang it. Why is this being, being a pain? Oh God, what the hell? Stop playing music. That was this is why okay. you don't click suspicious links, Nick. It, yeah. it wasn't a suspicious link, I swear. Uh-huh. Yeah. Uh-huh, uh, yeah. That's, that's what they, that's what they all they say. say. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> um, but, okay, yeah, I don't want to get into the rabbit hole of all the leaks and everything. <laughs> um, but, like, they're... I'm interested to see um, the starter evolutions after seeing that leak. No. No, I don't want to see him. If the leak is true, I just don't want to see him. I'm sorry. Well, because who are you? Um, who, who who are you choosing? <laughs> well, uh, I am. I'm <laughs> reluctantly at this current moment now more and more that the the leaks are coming true. Reluctantly, I'm choosing Score Bunny, but uh, he is my boy. I will stand behind my boy, even if his final evolution becomes a fighting, a fire fighting, <laughs> which Jerry will love, by the way. Yeah. He yeah. Will. I mean, he's he's definitely a card carrying member of the Score Bunny squad. So why? That's I mean, I'm not gonna think any less of him. I'll just be disappointed. <laughs> we have mad. enough firefighting. We have enough firefighting in the universe. I think it's time to give us something fresh and new. Yeah. Like I will legitimately jump out of my seat if we find out that he is a uh, a fire electric or a fire steel. Yeah. Mm. Fighting mm -hmm. or fire steel would be kind of interesting. So like that'd be a friend. wonderful combination, actually. Yeah. See, I, I'm Sabo Squad. <sighs> Nick. <laughs> I don't. I don't even know what to say right now. I can't really. I don't feel that way emotionally, so I can't relate to that, Nick. <laughs> <laughs> I don't feel that way. Emotionally. I don't feel that way emotionally. I can't relate to the mod. So, oh, sorry. <laughs> who, who said you had to? Oh, okay. I'm just not gonna question that. <laughs> <laughs> um, but next up on my list, um, was uh, crap. What was it? So, so me, me and Eternal were talking about this before we started. Oh no, the Untitled Goose Game. <laughs> Wait, what? Did I not hear about this? You didn't I didn't hear might. about this. I don't think I have. So I'm just gonna blob a picture of, of what it is on the screen right now. Um so what it is is pretty much you just get to be a goose. It, it's a stealth game. You just get to be an asshole goose. What what the heck? I just searched it up. Oh my, this is so weird. What? I just saw it on Twitter and I was just like, what is this? So it's basically just a goose simulator. Yeah. Yeah. No. What no. The... Okay. I like it. This this review of it. Untitled Goose Game is like playing Hitman as a goose. Uh, I I just I can't get behind that. I can't. And that's coming out for the Switch. Oh no! I yeah. can't get behind it. I can't. I just thought it'd be something kind of funny just to talk about. I, I mean, no, I, I can't. Let's be honest, all geese are evil anyways, so... I mean... <laughs> they used to call me the Geese King back in college. I the controlled geese the geese. Yeah. You controlled the geese? Yes. Did... I had, like, hordes walk around me all the time. You know was... what? I just have this I have this vision now of Tyler. <laughs> walking on campus going something like this. And all of a sudden the geese just, like, flock to him bring him things you know no he geese somebody over there that really annoyed him throughout the day he's like oh, and then they all like attack him and he, like, <laughs> no no so he's kind of like parcel tongue only with that's what i was <laughs> yeah geese or fly guess, me to class i guess i guess in this case it wouldn't be you know like the oh, it would be more like Honk. <laughs> and then uh <laughs> And, uh, I mean, it would be very awkward just to do that in the just, middle of... Just honk tongue, I guess. Honk tongue? Yeah. Oh. Um, Tyler, would you care to, care, uh, care to demonstrate some honk tongue? Got you, got you. Okay. So, quick, real quick, you, uh, you get in the middle of, like, an open area, and you just go, Haw! and then they come. Yes. Okay. <laughs> and that is all. Is there, like, different inflections? Like, if you, if you... 
how do you okay serious question bro serious okay. question. all right how do you how do you inflect sadness happiness you know i mean you, clearly there's got to be a divide because you got to make sure that they know what the what the emotion is right all right, so you have like a you have a command, right? Before you do the, you say like sad, half sad, half happy, half really emotional, um, half fly me to my class. Half That's it. Half fly me to my class. How many how many geese does it take to fly you to your class? On average, I weigh well. Let's see, I weigh about a hundred fifty something. So on average, it would probably take like about a good twenty twenty two, maybe twenty three, depending. But who knows. That is a lot of poop. Yeah, it'd be like that. <laughs> okay, so, it's a good thing I don't have to deal with it because I fly above. <laughs> okay. <laughs> okay. I use them. I that use is them. that is impressive. Okay. So they act like a, a geese bet. Then you're you're on top of the geese. They're more or less like a geese airplane. Yeah. Yeah. A geese airplane. Yeah. <laughs> more or less. <laughs> oh my god. <laughs> That segment just that that escaped me. Goose, um, angry <laughs> goose game. Honestly, I mean, yo, for if reals. you got, if you guys want to see Untitled Goose Game on the channel, let me know. <laughs> oh no, dog. <laughs> oh god, I, I think Tyler should stream that one. That'd Tyler, great. please, <laughs> please, I should. <laughs> 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 be like, what the hell is this? Show them the uh, masterful work that you command of the uh, the geese. <laughs> Hold up, this person I said can't. this game is so funny. I love it so much, and spamming the Y button, and, and I'm laughing so hard. So I'm assuming that's just a honk button. I can't assuming... do this. I gotta get out of here. I can't do this. Pre press Y for honk. Okay. Got it. <laughs> oh my god. Okay. So next up. Uh, is um uh pretty game i'm pretty excited about comes out this week um you could also just call it anime dark souls uh being code vein mm. and mm. uh i've i finished playing the tutorial and everything or not the tutorial the what do you want to call it the trial edition i guess and i had so much fun playing it um have you guys heard of it or no oh i uh 110 percent. i played the beta trial version demo version whatever you want to call it yeah wait so mm -hmm. are you ps4 or xbox i uh, you know what i played the fifth i can't remember which one i got it for <laughs> <laughs> i played the fifth you hate Dude, to see I, it, folks. I know you hate to see it but i i can't honestly remember all i know is that i played it and it was it was pretty cool. Yeah. I enjoyed it. Okay, so so Tyler, had you heard of it or no? I actually have not. Okay. You're so, enlightening me. So so let me let me just send you a picture of of what it looks like. Stylistically, it's Ooh. probably probably one of the most uh beautiful yeah. looking games because it's very, very, very anime. Number one. <laughs> It, it's anime dark so. oh yeah and it literally is but it's very it's it's cool and the customization seems to be yeah. pretty cool too well, I for some what? for some reason this art reminds me of astral chain for some yeah, reason i don't know why. yeah huh. um but yeah um because yesterday i was going through twitter and i saw somebody and they made almost every Ruby character in the Code Vein character creator. And huh. I was like, one, that's impressive <laughs> that you, one, found the time to do all of that, but that it has that much customization that you're able to do that. Tony, man, artists, people like that, they just dig, oh my God, I can't. <laughs> yeah, sounds about right. Um mm -hmm just artists are freaking talented man <laughs> that, that's quote me on this artists make me nuts sometimes there we go <laughs> got him <laughs> quotations artists make me, make nuts. me nuts sometimes yes artists make you nuts okay and then and then just tyler 
2019. Yeah. <laughs> okay. Uh. So, next up, uh, okay, I just saw a bug flying around my screen, and i not not happy about that. <laughs> so Kill it. Kill it with fire. See, it's a tiny bug, so I, like, have to pay attention for it. <laughs> oh. But also, kill it with fire. Yeah. But yes. Yes. I agree. Um, so, not sure if you guys care, but, uh, we're getting an Assassin's Creed manga of one of the side games. So it's gonna kind of, like, flesh out the story of one of them. And now that I've gotten back into manga... I'm actually kind of excited for it. Um, yeah. I guess that would depend on what it's side story we're talking about. It's um you know the Assassin's Creed Chronicles where it's like the side scrolling ones. Mm, like the China and the yeah. That's the only one I can remember. Yeah. Mm -hmm. Yeah, it, it, it's it's of the if it, it's of the China one. Oh, okay. And it sounded like it's going to be more because I think she, like, goes to Italy or something, and don't quote me on this, but, like, tries to get help from Ezio about something. Okay. Now, okay. Yeah. I don't know about that. <laughs> Gr granted, I said don't quote me on it. Right. <laughs> right. Um, They're so... still trying to cash in on how popular Ezio was, I see. Hold on. Assassin's Creed manga. Uh, is that it? No, that's that's from 2014. Hmm. What the? F <laughs> <laughs> Recent gaming news, guys. <laughs> yep. Recent gaming news from back in 2014. <laughs> Unless it like just tentatively got announced, because I saw it yesterday, and now I'm not finding it. Okay. It was five. What's five years in the grand scheme of things? It's all good. Thanks. Um. <laughs> now I'm gonna have to look this up just to make sure I don't look stupid. Nick's like, thanks, man. I already look stupid enough. Oh. Um, Ouch. Yeah. Now I'm. Now Shots. I'm, now I'm not seeing it. Pew, pew. Oh wait, no. There it is. Um. Apparently, a new sa Assassin's Creed manga has been announced called Assassin's Creed China, but it doesn't show like what it might be about so i may have just been making that up panda bears yes mm-hmm indubitably okay great and, wall and and as I, I, I as i looked it up um i just go through and i see disney is reportedly rebooting the assassin's creed movie with a new cast okay get it but like huh. why i i don't think it was bad it wasn't uh, it wasn't good but it wasn't bad i don't know i'm 50 i'm 50 yeah. 50 on the assassin's creed movie i i wanted to like it but mm -hmm. i think it was how they presented it yeah it was just kind of like eh, okay now not to spoil anything but like the whole last act of the movie mm-hmm like the last thing that happens, like the whole yeah scene, and so that was pretty cool. Now if yeah. they would have done that throughout the whole movie and done like you know missions like that and stuff, then that would be pretty sweet. Yeah, but I also understand and I also get that it was kind of like an origin story, and you have to find out how and why and all yeah. that crap too. So eh. that's why I'm fifty fifty on it. Yeah, because like everybody who went to go and see it, they were. They already knew everything about Assassin's Creed. Just because most... Everyone played the games. Right. Um... So, so we're just gonna keep... We're just gonna keep going. Um... So we also got a Final Fantasy VII remake trailer. It was either... I think it was this past week, right? Yeah. Yes, I did watch this. Yes. Yes. Oh, I can't wait yes. for this. Um... Be it, one, it looks amazing, and mm -hmm. um, my favorite screenshot from it is the um, hold on, uh, Aerith, is the one with Aerith and Tifa just 
being like, everything's fine. <laughs> oh, Nothing will happen. Yeah. Right. That, that entire thing. I just loved that scene. Um, if I, if I can find it, I'll block it on the screen. Um, so, yeah. But, so, so who, who, do, who are your guys? I, I guess who are your guys' favorite characters in in that whole scheme of Final Fantasy? I guess. Are we talking Final Fantasy seven or? Yeah. Yeah, just just seven for right now. Just seven for right now. Um, gosh. Okay, so I remember, I remember back when the original one came out on PlayStation, right? Yeah. The original the OG, mm-hmm. the OG PlayStation. Mm-hmm dating myself here but you know what everybody knows I'm, everybody knows i'm <laughs> old anyways so i really don't care at this point i'm only hey you just gotta I, own it way back in 1997 when most of you were probably not, not even, even a, a twinkle i'm still in the galaxy at that time mm, something like that but uh i i remember walking through i can't remember what store it was exactly i was in i remember walking through and i saw it on the shelf and i was like huh I remember that from like Nintendo. It's like, mm-hmm. okay, that sounds pretty cool. I didn't know they came out with a new one because that, you know, they were pretty quiet about it until they relaunched that. And I gave it a shot and I fell in love with it. Mm-hmm. And now here I am today, you know, one of the biggest Final Fantasy nerds in all of existence. You know, yeah. I play Final Fantasy 14. I love every Final Fantasy game. It's, it's great. But my team, my go to team, uh, in that game was always uh, Cloud, Vincent, and Sid. Okay. Hmm. See, I'm just yep. a, I'm excited for Tifa. <laughs> yeah, I am too. I no, I've only played really? seven. I've only played seven. I haven't played any of the others. I need to though. Um, but I I really liked Tifa when I played Final Fantasy VII. Mm-hmm. Same. Um. And and I don't think I'm prepared for um, you you guys know what I'm talking about, um, uh huh that that part with uh Aerith. Oh no no no! I, I am not ready for that in uh, crisp ultra HD. I mean, it's part of the journey, right? I mean, it is. I'll tell you what part of the journey I'm not looking forward to, and they actually kind of hinted on it. What? In the in the new trailer uh, with the whole Don Corneo part. Oh yeah, yeah, <laughs> yeah. yeah. That, that ought to be amazing. You want to talk about things that are going to be interesting in crisp, sharp HD? Yeah. Well, just because I haven't watched it yet, but I need to. The um, Final Fantasy VII Advent Children. I need yeah. to watch it. I got to do that too. Yeah, oh, you guys haven't watched it yet. I haven't. I, no. I've seen scenes from it, but I haven't like watched it in its entirety. Mm-hmm. But it that that's so beautiful, and that came back out and back in like two thousand nine. Yeah, and... it's a very beautiful movie. Yes, mm-hmm. uh, as far as like quality of story and stuff like that. Eh. Yeah, which is what I've heard. Yeah. It... It's a good CGI animated action flick. There you go. <laughs> Come for the action, don't stay for the story, because let's be real, it's kind of convoluted. But hey. We we don't watch movies for their story, we watch no. it for their animation. And we watch hey, it for the explosions. If you have a big brain, then oh. stay for it. Did Roast you guys it. just see the Discord chat? Yeah. Um, I'll just say, uh, feel free to join whenever. Yeah, our co-host didn't plug in his phone last night. Yeah, he, he, apparently his charger didn't get plugged in. So, that's what we call, as he would say, an oofer. Um. An oofer. Wait, what? Okay. Today's Earth, Wind, and Fire Day, apparently. Yeah. (laughs) (laughs) Do you remember? (laughs) What was that? The 21st night of September. Come on, Nick. What what are you doing? 
That was the intro. Yeah, it was like. Oh, yeah, it yeah. Oh, oh God. Oh, no, Nick. Come on. God. Wait, you know what? It's 745 here. Oh, okay, okay. <laughs> You're right. You're right. You have an excuse. Oh. Right. So, last but not least, on the gaming front of things, um, I saw it over on Twitter and, like, everywhere because everybody's freaking out. We're getting a Last of Us 2 announcement on the 24th. So I think by the time this goes up, it'll already be out. Ooh. So. Hello. Hello, Jerry. Hello. Welcome. <laughs> We're about 30 minutes in. It's okay. That's okay. It's okay. You're good. You're good. You, you're good. Um, so, so, guys, welcome Jerry in. It's like he was here the entire time. Hi, hey. Jerry. Hey. <laughs> So this is, this is what happens when you stay up to like yeah, two a.m. Yeah. after recording or after streaming Minecraft, hey, and then hey. start looking at computer parts. Hold, mm. hold, hold on, Jerry, I've got to expose you a little bit. <laughs> oh no! <laughs> I saw you in Frank's chat last night. Oh yeah, yeah, that's it. <laughs> While looking up computer parts, yeah. I I saw you in that chat and I went. Dude, why is this man still up? It's like two o'clock for him. Oh, cause we were cause we were streaming Minecraft for the new series on the YouTube channel. Oh, okay. Yeah, but yeah, no, I was like streaming Minecraft, and then decided, oh hey, I need to be looking up parts and understanding what's supposed to go into a freaking computer. Oh my gosh. Um. So yeah. On on The Last of Us 2 getting... Oh, wait, that's what we're talking about? Yeah, yeah, you came Oh, in. I came at the best time! <laughs> oh, let's go! Cause I'm oh, just... no. Nah. Catch me up, catch me up. Um, We we haven't gotten an official announcement, but they, they kind of just released a teaser showing that on the 24th we're getting an announcement at the State of Play. See, mm -hmm. okay, so I'm so happy about that <laughs> because... I have been waiting so long for so long. And granted, I did not play the game until 2015 when I first got my PlayStation. And for three years, it was the only game on my PlayStation that I ever beat. Mm -hmm. I still want that game. I didn't play Last of Us so many times, and I'm so ready to see the story continued. Yeah. I have to say, uh, the the original Last of Us was amazing. I oh was, yeah, yeah. I just the how how it started to how it ended. It was like, oh my god! It was a game, roller coaster. It was a yeah, roller coaster. It took me places I thought inhumanly possible that I could be taken, but it took me there. <laughs> yeah. Like, um, like, and I think like Nick, you've been in uh, like I know Tyler's been in those streams, but I think you've like popped in sometimes, like where. Mm -hmm. Will where I'll be like doing the one hundred percent run over on Twitch, and it's yeah. like, oh my god! Don't to, to anyone watching this, don't do the hundred percent run on the hardest difficulty. It is impossible. <laughs> it is it is actually impossible. Like I actually have to lower the difficulty down to actually one hundred percent to actually one hundred percent this game, mm -hmm. and it's just because you have to have like you have like those certain rooms and stuff like that. But unless you know which certain rooms have um each artifact that you need you'll waste your shivs 100 yeah. percent. and then the fact that the clickers literally kill uh like they pick up on any sound as well if you don't have any shivs or you don't have any ammo you're screwed yeah um gotta watch out for them clickers oh dude <laughs> <They're so laughs> clickers <laughs> yeah. God, tyler when you move down here you're playing you're playing last of us Okay, dude, I <laughs> I straight up can't wait for you to show Tyler so many games. Oh, it's gonna be a blast. Oh, um, yeah, I'm really cultured. It's okay, we get it. And, and show him more anime. Yeah, yeah. <laughs> <laughs> just make him a full quote unquote as he calls me weeb. I'm a I'm a pseudo weeb, but Nick's a full weeb. Like, I'm half and half. Jerry's just in the middle because Jerry doesn't watch anime anymore. Yeah, that's why I'm a pseudo weeb. So are you. <laughs> this is, 
it's I, I can't I can't wait to move in with Tyler so I can actually get off this campus and no longer be a full time student. Mm-hmm. Okay, so so we we actually started this talking about um like whose channel we found first in like the main friend group. So I started with Ryan, Eternal started with Dylan, Mystic started with or I don't know why I just called what? Mystic. Oh, no. That was oh, no. weird. What? Oh no 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 no! What no. was that? Oh god! I gotta get out of here. <laughs> <laughs> I've never done that. Like a what was yeah. that, Tyler? What? You know, you think you think you know somebody. <laughs> you know this somebody. man, like it's like you said that out of nowhere. It almost sounded like you just cursed Tyler out. Like what? <laughs> was, what was that? Okay. In my defense, I think it was because I went from saying eternal and then I just went to screen name. <laughs> I'm dying. Oh, oh my god, that was great. <laughs> and then, and then Tyler started out with Vinny. So I'm curious on who you started out with. Dobbs. You started out with Dobbs. Yeah. Okay. I was, <laughs> I was like, it would have been completely hilarious if you would have started out with Frank. No, Frank was second. I mean, close enough. Close enough. It was, close ma- enough. It was mainly that. like I can actually tell you like the first video of um, Dobbs I watched. It was actually his. Um, it was the series where he was like doing like the timelines oh, and everything. Yeah. That was the first series of Dobbs that I watched, and then that got me into like more Pokemon content. Mm-hmm. And so I was like, then he started uploading the Metronome battles, and so I found Vinny. Then I started actually no, yeah. So Frank was third because after I found Vinny, I watched. I started watching Vinny, and I started watching Soul Link, and then I just mm-hmm. started watching Frank more. Yeah. So we we all thought it would have been kind of funny if you your first one was like Frank, <laughs> said each of us would have had somebody of the core four. <laughs> that would have been hilarious. Um, what what was was there anything else I was gonna say with, about that? But I I don't think so. I don't. Um, yeah, no, you're good. So next up, we're gonna segue over into our anime news. Um, Speaking uh, of weeb and pseudo weeb, yes, let's go. Yeah, (laughs) let's do it. Well, I'm just gonna sit back and drink my uh, my Sunday delight. (laughs) (laughs) Call me back when you need me. Um. Okay. (laughs) No, I'm I'm kidding. I'm kidding. I'm kidding. (laughs) Are you though? Way to be okay, Jerry. I I literally like. I literally rolled out of bed when I saw your message on Discord. Well, I called you, and and it was kind of the same thing as, um... Oh, where, Charlie? Yeah. We, I got sent to a voicemail, and I just go, wow. <laughs> no, it's legit. My phone, like, my chart, like, I think the notebook that I was writing all my stuff in knocked my phone off the charger. Oh. Because, okay. it like, I woke up this morning, looked at my phone, and it was like, oh, it's 6 a.m. I was like, okay, only been asleep for three hours. Cool. So I turned back around and went to sleep. Next thing I know, my phone is dead. It's 9.55 in the, or it's 9 in the morning. <laughs> and my phone is not working. Oof. Thought I crushed it in my Oof. sleep. Oof. And now when I brought a whole new meaning to heavy sleeper. <laughs> oh, oh, Jerry, come on. Jerry. No. Okay. Welcome to immediately waking up, Jerry, everybody. Okay. That, that deserves some points right there. Heavy. <laughs> I have Round to. of applause. <laughs> Let's give some claps all around. Yeah, yeah Jerry. Woo! Yes. <laughs> <laughs> okay. So, um, first things first. Um, d- I, I don't want Tyler to make the joke because I know he will after I said that. Um, <laughs> But, uh, I know, I know Eternal's happy for this. We got Shield Hero Season 2 and 3 confirmed. Mm-hmm. Oh, that's an anime that I actually, actually have the anime pulled up on my computer right now. Dude, it's so good. I'm yeah. let, I, I let, I, I think I was going to watch it while I went to sleep. Never made it to the mouse to hit the click, uh, to click play. <laughs> <laughs> Never made it to the mouse to click play. I missed yeah, the sh- mouse. Shield Hero is one of those ones where you you look at it at face value and you're like, eh, it looks okay. 
and then but move it into it. <laughs> from what I, yeah. from what I heard, Doctor Stone is the same way because there was a stream. Yeah. Yeah. There was like a stream where I was hanging out with some friends, um, and I was like reading. I think actually no, I was hanging out with Nick. Oh yeah. I was actually, yeah I yeah no were. I was. I was hanging out with Nick and we were just watching, like we were like looking through anime and stuff like that. And Dr. Stone pulled up and I started reading the description for it. And I was like, this does not look like something I'd get into, but everybody loved, uh, likes it. So it's like, I, mm. I've watched, a, I think like the first five episodes, I need to catch up on it. But from what I've watched, it's actually really interesting. I have a, I have a confession to make. What? I still have yet to watch Dr. Stone. It, Same. I, but the thing of it is, is it's on it's on my recommended. It's on yeah. my queue, so I have to make the time to do it. This yeah, month. but I've I mean, heard nothing I, but good things about it. So yeah. yeah, I mean, I have a confession too. Everybody who knows me knows I'm a fairy tale lover. But I have yet to uh, finish season three. <gasps> I I refuse to sit down and watch season three until it's done because I plan to like. Well, actually, I'm just probably just gonna wait till Tyler gets here and then watch it from beginning to end. Yeah. Um, binge it. That's <laughs> just binge doing. it, man. Yes. Cause that's like, cause I feel like it's more satisfying. Cause like because of those gaps that they have in between, there are some details that are like left out that are that you forget about and everything like that. So it's like going back from the beginning and watching it from beginning to end, hundred percent probably worth it mm-hmm. to just do it all in one sitting. Well, right. I I did the same thing with uh, Demon Slayer. I didn't like start watching it right away. Mm-hmm. But by the time I found it, it was like in its 18th or 19th episode. Oh well, yeah, because episode yeah. 19 is the one everyone was like, "Oh my god!" <laughs> yeah, yeah. So I was lucky enough to be, and I, I didn't think I would like. It. And ironically enough, uh, I found it when we were down in Georgia. Yeah. Stealth and I went down to Georgia, and we were we were bunking with uh, Ryan and Frank. Yeah, and Brooks, and. Uh, Stealth and I literally stayed up all night long watching the first, like, three episodes <laughs> of Demon Slayer, and that's what hooked me. Mm-hmm. See, so, like, with Fairy Tale, as Jerry was saying, I'm I'm about 55 episodes deep in it right now. And, oh, and I'm for, from, from episode one? Yes. Yes, I <laughs> understand. I have a, a long way to Nick, go. I, but... Nick, um, what, what arc are you in? Tyler, um, this is not even a spoiler for you because you will not know what any of this means and you will probably forget all of this by the time you go back. Um, yeah, you're right. I'm in the Oration says. Oh my god. <laughs> oh, okay. What? I'm watching it. That's true. Uh, okay, okay. All right, all right. No, no, no. I'll give you credit. You're watching it, but oh my god. Wait, wait, wait. What, what part of the Oration says? Um, they beat Racer. Speed you racing. haven't even gotten to the best fight of that entire well, I, Again, I've got stuff to do. No, 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 no. I'm just saying. Just, just keep... All, oh, God. All, uh, all, I can, dogs, Jerry, huh? all I can say... Be, dang it, I don't want to spoil anything. Yeah, don't. <laughs> I, I'm just going to say... I'm just going to say, Eric. Okay. Eternal will probably... No, wait, Eternal, you're, you're a um, fairy tale fan, right? I'm I'm trying not to spoil anything either because my yeah. boy, my boy, yeah. my boy Blue. That's all I'll say. <laughs> my boy Blue. Uh, oof. My boy oh, Blue. Man. Oh yeah. Wait. Yeah. I um I haven't watched any of the new new the newest season like last yeah. season three because I'm That's... holding off as well. But I have watched everything up to that point. See, I watched some of it when it was coming out. Like so, when it first started, um, the first I think the first eight episodes were out and mm, no is that who you were referring to uh eternal i don't believe so no no yeah okay oh wait oh yeah oh okay wait 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 wait. eternal is it gravity yes yes (laughs) oh my god (laughs) so so i'm just in the dark now (laughs) <laughs> oh my god so you, yes you said my boy blue so that's immediately where my no 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 no. that's an actual character's name that's an actual character's name oh okay i um, was trying to be uh, clever while not being clever at the same yeah, time. yeah that, that was clever uh-huh. that was a clever <laughs> way yeah um but no like the first eight episodes 
I had already read because I was getting really, really tired of waiting for the final season. Because mm-hmm. there was a point where everybody was like, yeah, they're not going to do it at all. It was going to be kind of like the um, the Madhouse curse. Mm-hmm. Is it like that, which would have irritated me to all crap. Like, they did, they would have done exactly what they did to um, Rave Master mm-hmm. and not even finished it. And I would have been so upset. Um, so I read like the first couple chapters of the final season in the manga, which for everybody out there who does not know me, I hate manga. I really do. Well, I don't hate hate manga. I just if a if a series is out, I'll yeah. watch the anime over the manga. I'm sorry. I, I know there are like I know there are things that they don't put into the anime that are in the manga and stuff like that, but it's just I can't be bothered. I don't have enough time in a day to sit down and read. There are there are very few manga that I actually read religiously. There is a there is one that I will read religiously, and it's called Solo Leveling. And the the main man, Night Prowling Wolf, in my chats, aka Rob, has announced uh, has uh, made it aware to me that there is going to be an anime about that, and that. Uh, that makes me happy because yeah. that that manga is so good. See, back um, back in the day when there was the big three, right? The big mm-hmm. three back in the day, or the big four, I guess technically, uh, it was Dragon Ball, Naruto, Bleach, and One Piece. Mm-hmm. Oh, let's say, please for the love of God, do not put Yu Gi Oh in that. <laughs> no, no, no. Uh, <laughs> um, I I read Naruto religiously until it ended. I did not get into Boruto. I think the concept is kind of silly and stupid. That and they- I I agree to an extent because like the beginning, like episode one of Boruto, they start out with this like this super cool scene mm-hmm. with the new eye, like a new eye. Yeah, and then it's like, all right, now let's go all the way back to when he was a kid. Yep, mm-hmm. and we're still when he's a kid. I'm waiting for the time skip. Uh, Please, well, because if, if it's Naruto so to Shippuden was any kind of a, <laughs> any kind of a, a, a what it, am I trying to say? Indicator. Uh, if we wait, how many episodes was not just the regular Naruto? Like five hundred episodes? Uh, uh, let me check. The original one? No, uh, that one was like two, three hundred, something like that. Um, Shippuden was five hundred episodes. Yeah. Yeah. So Naruto originally was two hundred and twenty. There it is, yep. Then, I'm not sitting here and waiting for 220 episodes just for a time skip. No, <laughs> you got me messed up. You have me messed up. I'm 100% and... just going to start watching at the time skip. <laughs> Everything else, I'll just read on Wikipedia what happened. Mm-hmm. So, Shippuden, there, well, there's 20 seasons. Oh, yeah. Oh, yeah. Oh, yeah. Uh, 500 <laughs> episodes. Yeah. Shippuden was nuts. I... Everybody gets on my case about this, but Shippuden 100% is way better than Naruto. Oh my god, yes. They're, they're, like, the stakes are higher in Shippuden. They, it's just so much better. Yep. So mm-hmm. much better. Well, they're they're dealing with they're dealing with a lot more of the, the big threats. See, now in the original yeah. in the original Naruto series, when they were still kids, they only, like, hinted at that threat. Very small, mm-hmm. little... Yeah, know, and the big yeah. threat was, like, Orochimaru. Yeah, that's... Well, yeah, that was the big threat then, yes. <laughs> but it's, like, for me, Shippuden is a hundred times better than just the regular one. Just because it... Not only does it bring in everything from the original series, when we get to the freaking Great Ninja War, you get backstory, like... Granted, some backstory we didn't need it, and some of it was just straight up filler that was not needed at all because they went on for five episodes for no reason. But I digress because it was still great. Mm-hmm. It, it mm-hmm. got you connected more with the characters that you weren't originally connected with. Right, I agree, and that's that's circling back to the whole manga question. Um, I Naruto was one of the mangas I read religiously. Mm-hmm. Mm-hmm. I read I read that one from start to finish. I started the Boruto one, and when I found out that uh, Kishimoto, the original illustrator, yeah, didn't do Boruto, 
I, I gave it a shot. I read the first like two chapters and I was like, I can't get into this. Yeah. I, See, can't. Un- I was under the impression that they were going to do it like the movie, like Dragon Ball Z, or, like Dragon Ball Super did. And it's like, oh, the movie's going to be an arc in the uh, anime. The, nope. That I didn't like. They did? did? Like... Well, in Boruto? No, in yeah. Dragon Ball. Wait, 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 wait. No, you we're, didn't we're like not... the fact, wait, wait. You don't, you didn't like the fact that that they, they incorporated the movies and make the can't make them canon. Well, no, like if they Okay, so my whole thing was they did it better in the movie than they did in the show. For Dragon Ball. Well, yeah, that's the point. It's a movie. Right. But they didn't need to redo the entirety of both of the movies as <laughs> like reanimated. That was the only way they were going to make same. it canon though. That was the only right. way they were making it canon, though. Well, you you could just kind of say they were canon. No, nah, it's not worse. Because yeah, like, because you could like you, like, you can say because you, you can like because like you can mention that. I, okay, I I can give you that red. Well, because you they, yeah, they could have huh. done it. After. I'm trying to think cause like because like resurrection resurrection F could have been held off for a little. Like, what did they kill Frieza in resurrection F? Uh, no, because I don't think they did. Because no. he got he got revived. Okay, so oh oh, that's what our next arc should be. Oh wait wait wait, you're you know yeah yeah they had to have they did. Oh yeah they did. Okay yeah okay so yeah so no it's like that was the only way to get everything to tie in perfectly for the yeah, tournament of power. I guess that's true. See, mm-hmm. but but in my opinion, they should have brought back <laughs> Cell. <laughs> <laughs> no. no what no absolutely yeah. not no frieza was the best option uh-uh no 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 do you you honestly think cell would have cooperated with them i mean no do, do, do you really think frieza that did though frieza's better because now frieza can go and take over these other universes that were just brought back yep I mean... if cell comes back he's just going to destroy everything he's just gonna he's just gonna absorb everybody and just take over the one universe I mean, I guess. So is simple-minded compared to Frieza. Can I just say right now, I believe we're going to have to revoke Jerry's pseudo-weep card. (laughs) (laughs) Yeah, be that time, Jerry. (laughs) (laughs) No, no. These are like like the base that I've already been in. (laughs) Right. And this is and this is not a bad thing. I'm not saying that is a bad thing. No, it's not a bad thing because it's like you make fair points. It's like you make fair points, but it's like when you look on it on like a bigger platform and stuff like that, it's like it makes sense. It makes more sense for bring back Frieza. Because Frieza technically was the the biggest bad in the dragon. I mean, if you exclude Boo, which I'm so glad they didn't bring Boo back. Well, I mean he was technically no, 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 no! I mean, Kid Boo. Yeah, like the well, like the ghost, or yeah, yes, yes, Tyler. <laughs> yes, <laughs> yes, like spoopy, spoopy. <laughs> Ty- yeah. By the way, Tyler, how are you doing over there, man? Are you okay? Yeah, uh, you're just yeah this man here. is just here. <laughs> I'm just here at this point. Once we get to the anime parts, I'm always usually quiet. <laughs> This man is over there just like playing he's just, Pokemon he's, on his computer. He's just twiddling his thumbs. I'm like, so guys, yeah. <laughs> um, I'm here. Um, so next up. How did we get on that tangent? I don't know. I've just been here. I can't <laughs> no I don't know. Idea. Hold on. Oh, he's, <laughs> he's too uh, he's too busy plotting his next goose takeover. That's what's happening. Oh my, oh my. god. <laughs> First off, just quit reading my mind. <laughs> honk, 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 and honk. It's kind of like uh, it's kind of like uh, Kronk from Emperor's New Groove yeah. with squirrels, oh, just with these. <laughs> squeaky, squeak, squeak, yeah. squeaking. Yeah, exactly. <laughs> Squeaker, squeaker, squeak, 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 squeaking. Oh my squeak. god, <laughs> that, that movie's so good. No comment. No comment. <laughs> Only like, it's Tyler going. Honky honk 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 and honk. <laughs> it's like it's like no, it's like somebody walks up to you and so, yo, what's your talent? I speak to squirrels. Yep. Oh no, no, but, oh but, no. But, but in oh, Tyler's no. case, 
I speak to geese. Oh. Yeah. <laughs> I have a flock of 22 that fly me to school every day. What I, up? I, okay, no, that'd be, that'd be dope. That'd be dope. <laughs> I call him the Glock 22. I really wish you call him the Glock 22. <laughs> <laughs> I really wish Jerry was here when we were talking about that. Oh, uh, that, was, that was a good time. You missed oh. out. You had to be there. You had to be there. Um, I'll, I'll tell you after we're done recording. <laughs> yeah, please do. Oh my um, god. So next up, um, I guess kind of going on the shield hero thing, even though the last thing we talked about was Naruto and Dragon Ball. <laughs> um, yeah. I think it's going to be a browser game, but um, they announced the, the Rising of the Shield Hero relive the animation game. But I think it's just going to be a browser game, but it's done by the people who do the anime that's unfortunate i think they need a game game computer games now i mean yeah Um, like i mean like like cartoon network.com do we like that's like when you said it's gonna be like it's gonna be a computer game that's what my mind immediately went to and i'm like uh jerry i don't know disgusting know if you've heard of this one yet but are you uh, are you geeked about the fairy tale game yes yes i am (laughs) that game is immediately getting played on release Wait, are you serious? What? Okay, you so, serious? No, so seriously, it's, it, it's not. It's not like a um on a website or anything. It it's on Steam, but it's not in English. No, I think. Yeah, no. What did you? What did you? What did you think? But I wanted it in English. <laughs> uh, I mean, it's it's getting it's getting to the point where it's getting that popular, but it needs to gain a little bit more traction before well, it gets. Well, English no, not game. no, not. I'm not even talking about audio, just subtitle. Right. right. <laughs> yeah, no, it's, yeah. Japan gets everything before us. Well, yep. yeah. If it performs well in Japan, and if there's an outcry enough for it here, we'll yeah. get it. Just which there it is. Which there which, is. I'm sure there will be once they find out how awesome the game is. Oh, my God. Well, that's what okay. happened with that's what happened uh, with uh, my hero academia's uh or academia's uh, fighting game you know mm-hmm. came out just be glad you didn't it. say so to line i'm not gonna go back down that tangent for you nick but uh <laughs> oh okay god so, so i was going to but i didn't add anything because um they're releasing that... they're releasing a game for alicization why no it's... no Okay. No, I'm sorry. We're going down this route. We're going down this Damn route. It, oh Jerry. God, no, no. Uh, 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 uh. Okay. Every okay. Sword Art Online game that has been released has been absolute dog shit. Not all of them. <laughs> Most of them. Most of them. <laughs> Give me one. Give me one sec. <laughs> <laughs> Give me one. Give me one sec. Hey. <laughs> no. Okay. So. Okay, but Jerry, this this is alicization. This is actually good, Sao. Nick, Nick, what? <laughs> Don't make uh, me uh, get uh, crew uh, in this no, call. No, 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 no. Okay, no, because what Hollow Fragment takes place okay, in Jerry, Aincrad. Don't even. We're hollow not Fragment about takes hollow place fragment. In... again. Yeah, because it's the We're worst one, and it has turned me off of all of them. It has turned me off of all of them. I am I am bound to believe that every last SAO game is crap due to that one game. It should not take me four plus hours to get to the tutorial, and that's after me reading everything to a certain point and then skipping every dialogue in the tutorial. That was one stream, Nick. Just yes, one stream, and then I was done. Took you four and a half hours to beat the whole game. No, 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 no. To just get through the tutorial at the beginning. Uh, and that's oh, me wait. reading. That's like me reading the dialogue. And then at some point, just like start skipping. Oh, my God. Everything. That game is terrible. So, oh, and they don't even they don't even address you as your name that you put into the game. Like, it's like it's not like, a, oh, and then they just say like a couple words and they're like, yada, yada, yada. Oh, infamous. Yada, 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 yada. No, it's like I hate, hate you. <laughs> no, no, no. They're like, oh, Kiitukun. Like, what? Why? Mm. Also, um, for all of our young viewers, cover your ears. You can have sex with literally everybody, even Klein. You, you, Yo. re- you really didn't even give them a chance. <laughs> It'd be that time. <laughs> you, you just said cover your ears, and then you just immediately. <laughs> <laughs> like that. That's another thing. You can have sex with every female. 
antag or protagonist in the game. And Klein. Even <laughs> and Klein. <laughs> even your daughter. Eh? Yeah. 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 No, no, no. Let's point that out right there. We're we are straight up in the freaking south now. Let's go. Uh, right? Okay. We're we're in Alabama now. <laughs> yeah. No <laughs> doubt. Just add a clip of Dylan saw. No, it's Oh word. <laughs> yeah, it's 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 oh, bad. God. It's it's all yeah. bad. Okay, that I'll agree with. <laughs> um This game sounds great. I'm just not really Wow. Uh, I thought you were talking about a hollow fragment. I was like, if you no, want to no, play no. that, go ahead. Wait, go wait, right you, no, ahead. God, no. No, I'm good on that. <laughs> wait, are you talking about the new one that's coming out? Or or w- what game are you talking about? Three? Re? It's like quiet for like three seconds. Re? Just re? Question mark? Oh my god. Um, so. <laughs> Am I giving that up now? I'm, I'm never living that down, am I? You're not. You're not. Um, so next Somebody time. clip that, please. <laughs> just, just, just wait to the next episode of Trilink. Me and Tyler no, are going to intentionally no. be quiet for three seconds. <laughs> and then I'm just going to out of nowhere say, re. <laughs> Damn it. You're going to uh, hey, my Nick. episode, aren't you? Hey, Nick. Oh, my God. Nick, Nick. Yes? P2, P2, P. God. <laughs> I can't escape it. You're not going to escape it. <laughs> Um, I feel like there's a fun story with that one. Okay, uh, yeah, you, you know we're we're already down the rabbit hole. Let's just talk about so, it. So, uh, so it, do you do you want me to say it or do you want to? I I can. yeah. Go ahead. Go ahead. Go ahead. Okay. So for those of you who don't know, um, me, Jerry, and Tyler, we all started a, um, it's a three way soul link, um, but that's kind of just that that's kind of just not not important. So. What, was it our starters or was it one of our encounters? Was a peach? It was one of our encounters because you you were oh, me yeah. and Tyler, me and Tyler had got something great. You, yeah, you got and then and then I got a peach you, and then mm. both of them <laughs> two as as the peach comes on screen just start going peach you peach you peach you peach you and oh, ever ever since then whenever something like um so, something almost any Pokemon now it seems like comes up for me they'll just go <laughs> like like when a snubble came up for me they just go snubble 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 snub. snubble 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 snub. <laughs> i take full credit <laughs> and, oh no because tyler started it and i just started dying laughing and i was like yes let's make this a meme that's so, impressive yes um so yeah but but shameless plug go and check that out um i'm not I'm not sure if that will be an episode on on my side when when this goes up, um, but go go and check out on Jerry's and Tyler's channel. So yeah. Uh, Pichu Pichu. Are we recording? Wait, are we recording? <laughs> Wait, are we recording? Charlie kept to this. Not 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 right after this. We're doing it tomorrow. Oh, yeah. yeah. Um, I was confused by our DMs. <laughs> We're all confused at our DMs. Um, yeah. <laughs> yeah. Yeah. I'm just confused in general, so I mean... Okay. Pichu, yeah. Pichu, P. <laughs> yes! In on it. Yes! Yes! We're like... going to have an army to meet Nick at PAX with Pichu, Pichu, P. But now it's sad because Eternal's not going to be there. Uh, or, or, or is that still up in the air? I don't know because I I put that out into the universe and all of a sudden I have like eight people who are like so hypothetically if uh <laughs> so if hypothetically. Were to get tickets I'm like okay look all right look you know I have a I have a reputation for being you know cryptic and yeah. stuff like that it's not fun yeah to be on the other side of that 
Mm-hmm. Yeah, I can understand. I can understand now why and how Dylan, why Dylan frustrated. doesn't like it. <laughs> exactly. It's like wait, wait, wait. They're like, so is it? Is it more of a time thing? Is it more of a money thing? I'm like, okay. Well, here's the thing. I totally said at the current time. If they go on sale, I couldn't do it because you know we're yeah kid and all that good stuff. And, and honestly, congratulations because <laughs> oh, thank you. Yeah, you, uh, you but... and Sarah are gonna be such great parents. Yeah, Ooh. let's give a round of applause. Hey, Woo! Yeah, Ow! but uh, and, and, and then like immediately after I posted that, yeah, they were all like, "We wanted to meet up and blah blah blah." So hypothetically, if we wanted to get tickets. <laughs> So, would it so maybe would getting the time off be a problem i'm like it was never about getting the time off it was yeah. always about finding the extra funds to get the tickets yeah <laughs> so and i was like and by the way no you don't have to do that number two stop <laughs> number two stop <laughs> number it. three this isn't fun anymore number <laughs> <laughs> this isn't fun right right but oh. yeah i don't know so at, at the current moment i don't know I want to say I, I I want to be there with every fiber of my being, and I might. Who knows? I know. I don't know. We'll see. Uh, we'll and, see what the future it, holds. And if you are, you're you're just gonna be a part of their army, aren't you? Oh yeah, the the Pichu Pichu P army. <laughs> oh oh yeah, oh yeah, hundred percent. Let's go. I, I'm afraid you for never... you guys just to tell everybody else about this, and then when oh, you guys oh, see me, just we start know. doing it, and I'm just gonna be like, God damn it. Get out of my mind, please. Thanks. We could uh, totally amass the largest P2 army ever. Oh my god. <laughs> oh, it's going to be It's going oh to be freaking amazing. Yeah, uh, PAX is going to be great. I just need the tickets to go on sale. <laughs> um, so next up, um, I mean, I guess since we're all quote-unquote Poketubers, um, Ash one. <laughs> oh, no, no, uh, no uh, you know what? I'm keeping my mouth shut for this one. Keeping my mouth shut for this one because he oh, did not win. No, no, yeah. From from everything I've seen, it, it was he kinda, did not it, win. It was kind of BS. <laughs> he I did not, he did oh, not win that. Paula stopped his own grandson from winning. <laughs> yeah, yeah. See, no, that's no that he didn't win. He, no. no. No, no, no. Anyone, anyone watching this saying that Ash finally, like, oh my god, Ash finally won a Pokemon League. He won no, the he didn't. Islands. No, he didn't. Well, for starters, yes, he won the Orange Islands. Secondly, <laughs> secondly, and if you say you don't count that, uh, you still got it because it's kind of canon. But, uh, yeah, no, Ash didn't win. Here, but... <laughs> Yeah, see, see, but no, I see, would, look. I would prefer to remove that dark period from my memory. Wait, 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 which, <laughs> wait, which, which dark one? period? Ba- Battle Frontier. Oh, I thought you were talking about Orange Islands because of Trace. And that's saying a lot because Gen 3 is my favorite gen. Uh-huh. But we can erase the entire Battle Frontier, and I'll be very happy. Okay, but but the opening's a pop, though. <laughs> and it's even, and okay. Are you serious? <laughs> oh, so um, yeah, Kelly's gonna Kelly's gonna be crying in a like, couple seconds. Anyway, <laughs> okay, just pay just pay attention to your Twitter later. Um, oh, oh, oh okay. Um, anyway, um, so, but yeah, no, no, this is this is the stupidest thing ever. So, for I, I hate to take the rain on this, but this is like a topic I've been talking about nonstop all week with everybody in my school. Um. So if you let's let's just go back, right? We have Ash who loses seven regions in a row. We're we're excluding Orange Islands and we're excluding um, Battle Frontier. A Battle Frontier. He gets top sixteen, and, or no, it's top thirty two in Kanto, right? Yep. yep. Yeah. He gets top thirty two in Kanto. Sad. 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 No, Very sad. sad. <laughs> Stupid trainer. Stupid trainer. Yeah. You will never catch me in the top thirty two. No. No, oh. absolutely not. Okay, so so I just time stamped for myself. Um, I'm gonna try to find that picture because I know what picture you're referring to, where it yeah. like shows each one. The yeah. So he gets like t- he gets top 32 in Kanto, top 16 in Johto. Uh, what was it for? Was it top 16 again? I uh, yeah. In Hoenn. In Hoenn. Yep. Then he gets top four. No, it was top eight. It was top eight in Hoenn. Top yeah. eight in Hoenn. Oh, top it was eight four. in Hoenn and 
eight yeah. in Nova as well. Right? Yeah, it's like yeah. it's top four in um Sino, top Sino, eight yeah. in Unova uh yeah. in Unova, worst region of the entire world. Um then we get um runner up in um Kalos. Yeah. Yep. So we get to we get to freaking um wait, actually Alola. Wait, so actually for Kanto it was sixteen, Johto and Hoenn it was eight, as well as Unova. Sino was four, Kalos was runner up. Okay. Mm-hmm. So we get okay, then I give him a little more credit in Kanto, because if he was a top thirty two, I would have been like, All right, so I don't live in this universe to beat this kid down because he's dumb. Uh anyway, he's still dumb because he should have won uh he should have won Kalos. A hundred percent should have won Kalos. But you know the writers wanted to like yeah let's get one more season out of them, um, and then we get to Alola, yeah right yeah for starters can you really technically call Ash a real champion if he goes to an island that didn't even have a Pokemon League established until he got there, <laughs> and then won when nobody is like familiar with that type of setting yeah can yeah. you really call him a champion that's number one. Number two, no. <laughs> no. <laughs> just, no. He, just, was, no. he went, no. He, the battle continues because Rowley is asleep. I'm sorry, but whenever I watch Pokemon, a Pokemon gets knocked out, and then as soon as their trainer picks them up, they immediately wake up. <laughs> no, Rowley was knocked out. Rowley was KO'd. KO'd. 100%. Okay, so what I'm gonna do, um, cause when I when I saw it on Twitter, my favorite part was when um Galissapod got hit and then he just emerged or was about to get hit by the fire. Just emergency exit. And that just, makes me mad too, cause Scissor is like my favorite Steel type Pokemon. And I just love how Scissor's just like, shit. <laughs> The hell? <laughs> <laughs> He's like, you. Yeah. What have you done, Father? Why have you forsaken me? What quad week? Yeah. Yeah. He's just like, oh my god, why? <laughs> He's like, I'm just gone. Universe, like, why? I'm just gonna add the gif of that now. <laughs> it's like it's like his entire world, flashed, like his entire life, flashed before his eyes, and it was like, so, <laughs> so this is how it ends. <laughs> this, is, yeah. No, so I I saw something. It was like the the two be continued as it's getting hit. <laughs> yes. Um. Um. Okay. So, with all of that being said, um, the last our last two things, I guess we have our. Do you guys want to go with something that comes back next month or something that happened this month? It's up to you, man. I, wait, I wait, really wait, care. Wait, wait, wait. What are we talking about? I know what one of them is because if it comes back next month, there's only one thing coming back next month that's really exciting. Uh, yeah. Um, I have no yeah. clue. Oh, oh, wait. No, 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 no. <laughs> no. Wait a minute. Let me look at my calendar. One, one second. Un momento. <laughs> I just have no clue what we're talking about. Okay. That's okay. So, it's, it's October 4th, right? Uh, 12th. 12th. October 12th? <laughs> Yes. Okay. okay, ladies and gentlemen, boys and girls, October 12th, turn on your Crunchyroll subscriptions, whatever what? anime source you watch it on, because the number one shonen in the world is coming back, baby, and I'm happy for it. My Hero Academia Season 4. Or, or, or Jared yes! can just take it from me. Okay. Yeah. I'm sorry, man. I am hyped. That yeah. is like, after Fairy Tale, that is my favorite anime of all time. Mm-hmm. Yes. So, um, I take it that y'all have seen the uh, trailer for season yes. four. Yes. Yes. All see, right. See, Tyler, now, Tyler's just not caught up on million it. Oh. million dollar question: How many of you here? This is another one of the mangas I re-released. Nope. Nope. Way. None of it. None I've, of it. Have not read a single I've bit read, of it. I've read up to sixteen. I'm or no, yeah, sixteen or seventeen. So, um, are you referring have, to chapter or volume number? Volume. Oh, so you know what's going to happen then. Oh, yeah. Okay. So, so I have when been... I, when, in... I, 
state that this is going to be probably the best season of My Hero Academia. Oh, I can't wait. I already know. No, the way they made these trailers, the way they made these trailers, I already know it's going to be Yeah. It's, uh, it's going to be amazing. Just the, the storyline arc, um, the animation. The animation the be so character, the, the, the character arcs in this. The Okay, so from what I saw, Bakugo doesn't have a story arc in this. No. At all. Kirishima does. Yeah. Oh, yes! You you are going to you're going to yes. be focusing on a lot of it's Kirishima, who... isn't it? Kirishima and Froppy. Nah. No, no, no. It's it's Kirishima. Um. Um. Hold on. Whatever the heck his name is. Oh, uh, Lemillion. Mirio. No, 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 no. His friend, his friend, the one with the glasses. What, Sir Glasses. No, four Wait. eyes. Four, four eyes. eyes. Oh, Ida? Yeah, oh yeah, Ida. Oh, Ida already had his yeah, art. Yeah, Ida already had his. No, 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 I know like I know he's involved. It's like it's from that pic. I'm I'm trying to like think of like the the teaser poster that they released for it. Oh, Cuz everybody one... I think everybody in that doesn't they have like some significance to the story? The, the only one that was in the teaser trailer in the poster who has glasses is uh, Sir Night Eye. Hold on. Hold on. Um, Wait. And he was he was introduced very briefly in the last episode of season three. Yeah. Oh yeah, because he was the dude that trained uh, All Might, right? Didn't train well, him. No, he, he oh, was no, he was. Yeah, he was. Yeah, he was. His, okay, we're do that. <laughs> well, no, that was briefly mentioned. So that's it was briefly mentioned. Yes, that was he was he was. It's not kid. technically a spoiler. Yeah, true. Yeah, because he. He he does say that. I keep forgetting what has and has not been yeah. revealed at this point because it's been over a year since we've had My Hero Academia. Oh, yeah. man. Man, <laughs> I have been waiting for my fix. Like, I remember when the announcement trailer came out and I was streaming. We were watching that and I was like, oh, my God. Like, me and Krim got Japanese, like, Japanese wrong entirely because we were like, oh, my God, it's a spring anime. Let's freaking go. And then we we're like, oh, wait, no, never mind. Wait. A minute. <laughs> Wait. <laughs> um. Correction. But that it that should have been a spring anime. It should have. Oh, a hundred percent. I, <laughs> I'm so happy. I can't wait for it to come back. But um, I'm but... I'm okay with the wait because I think they had to take the extra time to get the animation right. Mm-hmm. For from what wait. I've heard, we're gonna get like the time skip in probably two more seasons. Okay. From what we're getting, the, we're getting the time skip in like two more seasons. Okay, which I'm excited about. Um, cause cause the thing I was gonna talk about for the for for my hero was the new key visual that they released. Mm. Um, and I'll I'll put that on the screen. Um, mm-hmm. uh, hold on, let me let me make sure that was. Was it this week that we got that new one or no? The one with um Mirio and uh Deku. Oh, oh, oh. So you stop out. dropping names, stop dropping names, stop dropping names. It, he was Mirio, introduced you... last season. <laughs> oh no no no. I thought you were talking about the, the one chick. No what, Nijire? Alright, yeah, good job, Nick. Was... Good job, Nick. Yeah, she was introduced last season too. Nijire, yeah. Nij- uh, the, 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 wait, the Amajaku. The, the one the girl that's gonna be like the main focus oh no oh no uh, the 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 girl who's gonna be the main that, focus. that's what i was talking about that's no. what i thought you guys... i was talking oh, about no. blue hair girl yeah um but wasn't this this one released this this yes. yeah yeah, yeah. Okay. that's why i was like froppy i couldn't remember if ida was in this one but i was like froppy is involved because uh yeah. it's something i'm involved and yeah. you, you know the number one waifu of my hero she's not my waifu Froppy's my wife, who I don't care what anyone says. Um, Uraraka has to be involved somehow, <laughs> some way. <laughs> you mean the best goddamn cinnamon roll? Uh, <sighs> if, if only I could just sit here and dish about the entire arc, because this... All right. I'm current with the manga in, in My Hero, and mm-hmm. I have to say out of everything that they've ever done, this is by far my favorite arc in the entire yeah. series. It, 
the 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 characterization, the villain, the everything is a whole nine yards. It's like ridiculously good. And and the so, stakes, everything, yeah. everything is just so high and so good. The action, oh. So the other thing I'm excited for is is the movie. Whenever that ends up coming out, because I think it's right. gonna be, I think it's gonna be this year. Maybe because they say I will, I will be skipping work for this movie. I called like I legit called into work for the first one. Went uh-huh. did not go to class for the first one. I will not be going to class, nor will I be going to work for this one. Well, because <laughs> I have the black lung. <laughs> 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 oh no my excuse is like because they know i have like migraines on and off that's my uh, that's been my excuse uh, so i'm like yeah your advantage huh yes i am 100 yeah. percent abusing it um, granted paybacks uh, uh payback yeah. comes and bites me in the butt so uh i'm just waiting for it so, just waiting for it to happen so hold on let me because i just saved it but um, the thing I tagged you and Krim in yesterday. Oh, yes. That, that gives me even more excited about it. Okay, so for some reason I put it in that folder, and I don't know why. Um, so I'll blop that onto the screen too. Um, so, yeah, that looks amazing. <laughs> and yeah, that's pretty, that's pretty sweet. I am Deku. I I saw it and I was just immediately like, that got me more excited. <laughs> mm-hmm. Um, mainly because Kid Todoroki. <laughs> let's just let's sit here and respect the fact that yeah, look at all of the little their little kid versions, dude. They're they're all like so hyped and excited. Yeah, oh, except for Todoroki. <laughs> except for Todoroki. <laughs> or like Todoroki is too. He's just got a different way of showing it. Yeah, I just like. Oh yeah, I know. Just it's, like... just, it's just there's facial expression. No, no, yeah. no, Jerry. Oh wait, 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 wait. Look, it's like a line. It's like yeah. it's like a change of expression. It's like, oh yeah, let's get it. It's like, wait, no, what? No, and then it's like, oh, you <laughs> bastard. No, no, Todoroki's like, I was, I was gone for a minute, but I'm back. Uh. <laughs> um, but yeah, so we could probably nerd an entire episode about my hero because. It's so good. <laughs> um, but my my final thing was, I don't know if any of you guys wanted to go see it, it uh, Studio Trigger's new movie. Um, <sighs> oh, uh, the one skip that topic. looks like a blatant Gurren Lagan. Skip, 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 skip no, the topic. Jerry, skip I'm the not topic. skipping it. No, no, I'm, skip I'm the topic. No, about... why? No, 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 you want to know why? Because I had to fucking miss out on it because of work. I'm not talking oh. about story. I'm just talking about how good it was. Oh, I know it was good. So I have to wake up every day to the anime club and listen to how good. But uh, <laughs> no. So, so Promare? Go... What's it called? Uh, Promare. Pro... Yeah, Promare, Promar, however that you want to say it. <laughs> All right. <laughs> um, but I went to go and see it on Tuesday, and it Studio Trigger knows what the hell they're doing because their animation they do. is they do. so good. Mm-hmm. And um, the one thing I will say, <laughs> there's one part in it that, well, no, there's like two two parts in it where you can see that they totally like, not technically ripped off because it's their their own product, but you can see Kill a Kill and Gurren Lagann in it, and you'll mm-hmm. understand that when when you see it. But I was just like, oh my god, that's totally like Gurren Lagann. <laughs> I, uh, I mean, they have Kamina in it. Yeah, I, when it when the stuff first came out, and I saw the protagonist, I was like, "Huh, that's, uh, <laughs> that's totally that's totally Kamina." <laughs> <laughs> I was like, "Yeah, uh, what?" Yeah, no, yeah, I'll agree with that, especially after seeing it. He's he's not as dumb as Kamina because Kamina was smart. Wait, 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 wait. His name's not even Kamina? No, hit no. No, it's a uh, Gallo. All right, worst movie of the year. Continue. <laughs> <laughs> wow. It's so stupid. It's so dumb. Okay. But like watch it when you can. <laughs> um Can I just say something to trigger the entire chat? Oh no. 
Queen, I am joking about this. Everyone else, this is a joke. Shrek is terrible. Oh, no. <laughs> I'm scared. I, I just said it. Shrek is terrible. Oh. I, I'm kidding. I'm kidding, of course. But everything after Shrek the First is stupid. It it kind of is. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, you're, you're getting zero arguments from me. <laughs> <laughs> well, okay. But two isn't that bad. Two is not bad. One, one and two is, aren't bad. The third is just pointless, and Forever After was just not needed. <laughs> <laughs> you're right yeah, we're, talking, movie, we're talking about anime good times good dude, times dude shrek is the best anime <laughs> 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 um so that actually rounds up all the anime news and everything um so i love how shrek was now part of the anime <laughs> Uh, my, fa- my favorite anime or my favorite arc in that was the uh dragon donkey arc oh yeah I'm most definitely yeah. the i need a hero arc just the, connection, just the connection between the two characters, amazing. Yes. Dude, the character <laughs> development, amazing. Uh, so Bro. tops. Do you know okay. the Muffin Man? <laughs> <laughs> the Muffin Man arc. Favorite boss not, fight, Muffin not Man. Not my gumdrop buttons. <laughs> <laughs> okay, okay. So I know this is going to make a lot more sense um, after we tweet it, but can all of us just tweet at the same time, Shrek is the best anime? <laughs> Yes. <laughs> yes. Yes. Just tell me when. Wait, wait, Jerry, are you typing it in right now? Oh god. So are we doing this? Like... Yeah. Okay. <laughs> are, we, are we dropping it now or yes, what? Yes, we're I dropping just, it now. I just, I just, I just <laughs> Everybody's gonna be like, what the hell? Um But let's get into the questions. Um so so we we, we didn't have any uh Twitter questions. So uh yeah! let's go. go. Your boy just had to kinda not not I kinda kinda gas recycle, but kinda just flip them into kind of our own questions. Mm-hmm. Um so first up um because i know eternal you you kind of you you watch a lot more anime um so what what seasonal anime are you gonna be watching i guess it would be fall i guess now yeah uh, okay well obviously top of the list is my hero well yeah that's that's a no-brainer um as far as other ones than that i don't it's getting harder and harder to find out what season or what what show and what season is going to fall when. That's I true. guess. Um, uh, like I don't know. The the thing I'm really hinging on right now is I it, we're getting up into episode I think like 24 or 25 of Demon Slayer now, yeah. and I'm very 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 upset that it might be coming to an end for season one. Yeah, it. I think it's 25. 25 and 26 is normally when it comes to an end. And that's unfortunate because I love that show so very much. Um, um, uh, but my hero definitely is top of the list. I cannot wait. I've been waiting for over a year for that beast to come back. Yeah. Um, I will dare. I dare say that my hero academia is probably in my top three favorite animes of all time. Okay, so for for Demon yeah. Slayer, it is twenty six episodes. 26 episodes yes. oh boy so there's so there's only a few episodes <laughs> left that's unfortunate <laughs> <laughs> turtle's like damn it now i Wait, have to now i'm myself. reading the comments somebody reply on mine oh no <laughs> roy and arcanine said oh no it's cory in the house but strick is a strong second yeah <laughs> oh my god yeah, that's good <laughs> <laughs> somebody already retweeted mine <laughs> oh my god wow <laughs> So, um, yeah, because there, there's actually quite a few ones that I'm looking forward to. Um, so there's the new Fate one, uh, which is based off of the mobile game. And it's going to be animated, so that's going to be great. Yeah. Mm-hmm. Um, there's, uh, what, what else is there? Is there actually not as many as I thought there was? <laughs> This is the this is the best thing I've ever seen in my life. Oh oh no. Um 
but yeah there it there's always a couple of like random ones that i'll i'll like watch the first episode and then i get hooked on them right i you know and honestly uh, i when i look at anime i look and i see if it looks good and i'm like oh hey that looks kind of cool. whoa what is this God. discord update on my phone whoa <laughs> Jerry, we're talking about anime, not Discord. I mean, if you see why, if you see what I just posted in chat, you'll understand why. I was on- oh, that just lends further credence that God is indeed on his side. <laughs> Thank you, Jesus. Yeah, Thank you, Jesus, for using Thank Code you. United. Yeah. <laughs> uh, I'm watching pictures yeah. of that on there. <laughs> that is the best. That is the best statement to come dude. out of my mouth, dude, ever. Dude. He- even he the man with- upstairs uses Code Code United. <laughs> I mean, he hangs what. out with him on the weekends. He does. No. This is true, yeah. Um. So. Yeah, because they're also doing uh, Psychopaths season three. I think it is. I need to actually catch up on that. I, I, I need to. Like, I need to watch it. Like I started it with one of my. I started with my one of my best friends and um, just never finished it. Like yeah. Because he had, like, insomnia, so he could sit down and watch an entire anime in mm-hmm. a night. I couldn't. I mean, that, that was kind of me with Gurren Lagann. I've watched it in less than a day. <laughs> um, I don't know whether to be disappointed or proud of you. I don't know. Yeah, both. It does a little bit both. <laughs> a little bit both. I, I do have a question for all of you. Yes. What is your take on fried pizza? What? What? <laughs> what just just answer the question um i've never had it i can't it doesn't need to be fried (laughs) yeah you don't really have to fry it i mean i guess if if you want to like die sure but i mean i guess i don't know nick just get ready to blop something onto the screen okay oh Oh, boy oh no what Okay. Uh, so, so while Jerry's sending me that, I guess yeah, we'll go on to the next question. Um, so what is one thing in your life? Yeah, yeah, we're getting deep here. Um, Ooh, deep. Okay. What is one thing in your life that you're most looking forward to in your future? So one I thing... want you to know, I fought the urge to say, but Nick, I can't swim. God. <laughs> you make no sense right now. No, he's like, we're going to get deep right now, and I was about to say, Nick, I can't swim. Oh, uh, okay. All right. <laughs> wow. All right. Okay. Oh but, boy. But what's one thing that you're looking most forward to in your future? Uh, being roommates with Tyler, and having Shiny as my roommate, as well. Okay, I, I kind of figured that'd be yours and Tyler's answer. Yep. Uh, actually, I do uh, have. Okay, okay. Uh, no, no, no. I kind Ouch. of have. It's still the general, like general, like point. Yeah, I want to go down there, but I like. I'm kind of. I'm not an advocate on mental health, but like I and, <laughs> and, and like eternal knows, but like I, I really try be positive no matter what i'm in but like i just i can't wait to get out of the situation that i'm in Mm -hmm. and it's just gonna be like such a relief for me so yeah oh tyler how did you like your birthday uh birthday oh yeah yeah, that was great i wanted to thank you i actually was gonna bring that up and i had a question for eternal later on as well but like I, I really wanted to thank you guys for that because I was sitting in, in my car. I was eating stuff for my birthday and I was crying in my car. I'm like, oh my God. I'm like, this is great. No, I'm like, I really appreciated so, that. So Jerry made a Snapchat group um, after we had recorded those episodes and he just added like me, Eternal, Shiny, Libby, all of us into there. And he's like, so I want you guys to send me a birthday message to Tyler. And, yep. And... After that, I was just like, dude, he's gonna. Because what, what did I say to you when we were in that call? I was like, oh, you, you're he's like, he's gonna, gonna be cry. really mad, or he's, all right, gonna, he's, gonna, he's cry. gonna cry. Yeah. <laughs> but I, I watched all of them before I sent them over, and I'm like, dude, this is. I, I love my friends. But why would I be mad? What? <laughs> that but, makes no sense. Because we, we were keeping it from you. 
okay. <laughs> I'm not going to be mad. Not mad, but you get what I mean. Yeah, I do. <laughs> okay, I do. but Eternal, what is one thing you're looking most forward to? In the well, in the immediate future, obviously, well, yeah. uh, immediately, immediate future, obviously, it's got to be my kid. Yeah, that's that's something that uh, I know specifically, and, and me too, me too. Don't get me twisted, uh, because I've always wanted to be a father and all that good stuff. But uh, but my wife, uh, Sarah, I can't say enough good things about her. She um, she has wanted to have a kid for so long. When she got the news that. Um, she couldn't have one naturally through childbirth. She was like absolutely destroyed, absolutely devastated, you know, mm -hmm. uh, and for good reason, you know, she'd be a, she'd be a fantastic mom. She, she's going to put me on blast for this. She listens. She's the, one of the most shyest introverted people you'll probably ever meet in your life. Uh, she doesn't have social media. She doesn't really do anything, but she watches. That's the funny thing. She watches uh -huh. everything. So <sighs> he's probably going to destroy me for this later, but I don't care. <laughs> uh, <laughs> Uh, but um, for the longest time, you know, she was she got into this funk and this depression where she uh, she just didn't know what to do because she got that news and it was just so hard for her to swallow. Uh, and, and even with her being so introverted and stuff like that, you know, I still see that she's going to she has the makings of a fantastic mom, and a fantastic mother, and that we're able to give another child who is in need a second chance. I think that's a second chance for both of us, both parties, you know, for the kid and for us as parents. Mm -hmm. So I think mutually that's that's one of the biggest mm -hmm. things that I have to look forward to. Uh, it's just that. And that's happening really soon, guys. Really, really soon. Yeah. Hooray! We literally, we literally met. Uh, we met her last week. Uh huh. And I can honestly say, you know, I've I've described love before and I have. Mm hmm. I have felt love before, but I have not felt it on a level like this. Yeah. It's nuts. It's absolutely insane. It just makes my heart so happy for you guys. <laughs> I'm so happy. It does. It's, it does no, it's, it's awesome, guys. So, and, and I can't wait to share more. I, I took pictures, but I'm not going to post yeah. anything yet just for, you know. Uh -huh. I'm, a, I'm a huge person into, you know, uh, superstitions and stuff like that. I don't want to jinx anything or jinx anything or anything like that by putting things out there before it happens but soon but yeah like it it especially with knowing you i guess for how how, how long would you say i've known you probably since this summer like i would actually, say so, yeah. actually talking and stuff i guess yeah. um but like just talking to you and just kind of knowing you 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 and Sarah seem like the most nice, genuine people ever. <laughs> oh, thank you. Don't tell her that. She's got a mean streak. I'm kidding. I'm kidding. So a joke. She's, she's very lovely. Um, she's going to watch this and be like, And here, here's you. a little known fact. I know uh, she is a, I think she's even more big into anime than I am. Really? Oh, God, yes. Punk? <laughs> Tyler Pog. Yeah, no, it's it's. Uh, she has a um, she has a shelf of literally uh, like there's Deku, um, there's Ultra Instinct Goku. There's a bunch of different uh, for animes I don't even know. Yeah, like statues of figurines and stuff like that. So she's she's got me trumped on that. <laughs> Damn. <laughs> um, <laughs> but yeah, um, one thing I would probably say is honestly just just the future in general like packs um oh yeah um kind of just kind of just like everything with our channels and stuff it's it's insane to think that we're we're slowly growing at all times mm -hmm. and um no matter how slow it is the it's it's the journey getting there um making what you want and something that you're proud of is it's something amazing and i'm i'm even considering bringing stuff that's stuff you wouldn't expect from me to the channel it's it's interesting to think about like 
if if this is gonna do good if it's not and if you enjoy something honestly if you're a content creator if you enjoy something you don't think it's gonna get received well do it anyway i mean yeah like i'm i'm considering bringing what was it um like the you guys know the batman arkham games Mm -hmm. down to terrible game no. Jerry hates Batman in general for those. Yeah, I, 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 for, for everyone, for everybody who does for, does not know me, I hate live action Batman and I hate the Batman video games. I, I love cartoon Batman. I just hate the video games and I hate live action because they can never get them right. It irritates me to all heck. Okay, but continue with what I was saying. Um, I was your comment what, section for you. The, <laughs> um, I'm considering bringing that to the channel just because I've. I don't care what you think, but I've enjoyed those games. <laughs> um, and yeah, I, no. If you 100 percent enjoy yeah. the game, then do a series on it. You know, yeah. Like, you never know how. Like, it's it's not about like yeah. if the series will be perceived well. You're doing the series because you love it, and it's the same with YouTube. You're doing YouTube because it's yeah. something you love doing. So why why not do something on um like not why not do something on something you do. Mm -hmm on the platform you love to do things on yeah because i mean um now i think about it i've i've technically been on youtube since 2014 believe it or not but i've kept being being on and off and now that i'm like actually i guess what's the word i'm looking for actually on like consistent like consistently on yeah yeah consistently like putting out content and everything it it's something i'm more proud of and um just kind of making it my own and mm. and growing as a person and making so many new friends i never would have made i mean the people in this call i never would have met them if if not for like going into other people's streams um all that kind of stuff like straight up i wouldn't have known eternal because um if i had never found like dylan because i'd always see him in chat like when i'd say hello he'd be like one of the first people to say hi back it it's just insane to think about um yeah I, i'm going on a huge tangent and i'm no that, that I, i'm actually... almost like in tears <laughs> It actually reminds me of a, a question I specifically have for you, Eternal. And I wanted to ask this, but I didn't find the right time. So with all the people going oh. down to Georgia, do you think that it is a good move on the people that are like small, like kind of like smaller S creators going down there as well? Or do you think it's kind of like a big risk that they're like, not just they're taking, but like also the bigger channels are taking as well. Cause they're in a, con uh, like an area where it's more together. Right. No, that's a great question. Um, I see it like this. It's, it's, it's a big risk on both parties. Yes. But um, I can say this from from exposure, from actually being down there, from from checking things out, from uh, getting a standpoint of how everything is set up, it will do absolutely nothing but benefit everybody. Number one, it will benefit the smaller content creators because you're getting exposure. You're going to get exposure like you have never gotten before. Mm. Uh, you know, you have you have the the guys that have you know like 200 plus 200k plus subs like Dylan uh and then you've got the the people who are taking off like a rocket ship right now like Frank and Ryan and and even people like TJ Lynn Yeah and now that TJ and Lynn's are down there too they're going to you're going to see them grow exponentially and the the best part about it is is that you're down there in close proximity so now you have all of these new options for collaborations mm -hmm. you have you have cameos, you have, you know, guest appearances, you have everything that you can do now mm -hmm. that you would not have been able to do otherwise because, you know, time and location is a huge factor in yeah. all of that. Uh, having this community, and, and it's funny because Dylan and I had a really long, awesome conversation about it when we were down there, we were walking around the neighborhood and stuff, you know, it's, it's insane 
to think that he had this he had this vision of getting a community together where people could just promote growth mm. and that was his that was his big deal he wanted to promote the family and promote growth yeah uh, and have an avenue and a uh, a platform where people could come together create new series new ideas and just constantly bounce ideas off of one another to help each other grow you know and, and now here we are you know frank's down there ryan's down there tj and Linz are down there now uh, and you got so many more people that are that are planning on going down there as well. It's nuts. Mm -hmm. uh, before too long, that whole subdivision is going to be <laughs> nothing but YouTube content creators, you know. But mm -hmm. the thing that blows my mind is that it got enough traction to actually work. And I'm not saying this to knock anything, but because you know, moving is a huge commitment. Massive no, yeah. Commitment. Yeah, I I mean, you're 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 asking to you're asking someone to uproot what they have and what they know now, and take a big gamble to go down and start something new. Um, but that's just it. Nobody in this, nobody in what we do, got anywhere without taking a risk. Mm -hmm. And a lot of times, you just have to jump in uh, and see if you sink or swim. And, and, and to be honest with y'all, I, I think it's it's a boon for anybody who wants to make the commitment to do it. But know that making this commitment is more than just saying, oh, yeah, I got to pack everything up and go down there and everything's going to work out. It's a lot of work. It's a lot of time. But it's an investment, you know, not only of time and money and resources. Mm -hmm. But in the long run, yeah, it's definitely worth it. It's yeah. most definitely worth it, for sure. Which... I don't I'm I'm not saying I'm going to but um it if the what what's the word I'm looking for the opportunity like presents itself that I I'm like 100% that I want to move over there I mm -hmm. will but like Arizona's always going to be home to me <laughs> um, Oh yeah I wish I could say the same about Arkansas. Well, well, yeah. <laughs> yeah. Me and Jerry are trying to make the commitment as best we can. I mean, like like I said earlier at the beginning of this year, I plan on going down mm -hmm. to Arkansas and then eventually to Georgia mm -hmm. with him, even if it's just me and Jerry, honestly. Yeah. Like um, I'm fully committed and I'm yeah. ready to make the move. And I know it's gonna be a lot, but yeah. Oh, yeah. But um yeah. So <laughs> God, we got all sappy. Oh, I, I also, I also have to say this: the the area down there is fantastic. Mm -hmm. It's amazing. That, that's what I've heard. You've, I mean, you've got everything under the sun right in proximity. It's great. I mean, you got you got hibachi. So, so what what's what else do you need? <laughs> yeah, exactly. So Dylan is going to legit drag me to hibachi because I have never had hibachi. You have never, <laughs> you've never mind. had hibachi. Same here. Yeah. Wow. I don't even think we have a hibachi here. Uh, that's the the where they they cook it in front of you on the slab and all that. Yeah, I don't think we have nope. that here. Nope. Oh. No, you guys are in for a treat. Well, that and that uh, the 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 place that they actually go is amazing. Oh my god. Mm -hmm. Um. I yeah. feel like they've already like memorized the name and <laughs> they're probably like, we, we know oh, what they're in getting. here again. It's just like you know what they're getting. <laughs> Yeah, no, it's it's uh, it's fantastic because they go in there and they're like, "Oh, hey, how you doing?" They're like so friendly with them. They're in there so many times. It's like the wait staff knows them by name now. <laughs> I don't they, know they, if that's good. They or bad. may actually have a, a a table that they use too. Yeah, <laughs> it's ridiculous, but it's awesome. So oh, yeah, yep. um, so God, we got all sappy for like twenty minutes. <laughs> Um, that's okay honestly i'm glad because sa sappy is always nice um so before i get on to my last question i've got if you could go into uh into the world of any anime what would your top three choices be fairy tale <laughs> all three okay fairy so <laughs> so um this this isn't even a matter of like if you'd be safe it, it'd be kind of if you had like I guess, quote unquote, plot armor. So, like, if I wanted to go into Attack on Titan, I wouldn't die immediately. <laughs> Why would you want to go in that world? Why, that, you, you're not getting saved by plot armor. You're still going to die. 
I mean, I guess. Yeah, that's that's probably one of the worst ones to go into. I no, would say. No, that was just, <laughs> that, that was just that was just my. Any, anyone that says, "Yeah, I want to go into Attack on Titan," I want to die. <laughs> that, that's essentially your mood on right. what you want. I mean, unless unless you become like this really badass, awesome like Mikasa character. Right. Yeah. <laughs> Mikasa type. Because, like, let's just be honest here. Not even Aaron has plot armor. Mikasa has plot armor. Well, I mean, kind of, kind of, so does Levi. There's a lot of people in that show that have plot armor. Let's just be real. Yeah. Except for Aaron. Well, yeah. Uh, And he he kind of. Aaron Aaron's just stupid. Let's just let's just. Yep. Mm -hmm. (laughs) Hey, I can relate. Yeah. (laughs) So. So if I had to do my three choices, um... I say that was going to be one of them, watch. Wait, so you, you want... Okay, so any three anime worlds yeah, we can yeah, yeah, your top three choices. Oh my god, okay. So I, I kind of didn't want to just leave it up to one because otherwise it'd be like, we'd be here for an hour trying to figure out what. <laughs> um, so mine would Fairy be... Tale, my hero. Mm-hmm. I was going to say my hero. Um... And honestly, I would say, so my hero for me. You know what? No, let's throw a slice of life in there. Your name, or not your name? Um, you're lying, April. There yes. we go. There we go. Oh let's God. throw. Let's, do, let's do throw one mean. that doesn't have any freaking risk whatsoever. Do Actually, you... no, I'm taking that off. No game, no life. Wait a minute. No game, no life. I was about that's to not say, that one. I, that's like one of your favorites. I'm surprised it wasn't on there. No game, no life. <laughs> So, I take that one back. <laughs> so Jerry, two of ours are actually probably going to be the same. <laughs> yeah, if I, if I can live in fairy tale, dude, amazing. If I can live in my hero, give me my powers. <laughs> give me my powers. <laughs> uh, if I can live in no game, no life, you're telling me everything in the world is legal except for death. <laughs> you can't kill anyone in that world. Mm-hmm. Yes. Can we get those rules over here in America, please? America, explain. <laughs> um, so yeah, I'd say My Hero Fairy Tale, and I mean, um, honestly, I kind of like the Year in April route, but also there's Full Metal. Eternal, have you seen uh, No Game No Life? I have recently just started that. Yeah, oh, it's so good. Yep. I'm I've only made it through the first episode though. So Do not watch the movie. <laughs> Don't watch the movie. You will, okay. No, no, no. This is this is why I say this. And everybody's gonna like everybody will agree if you have seen the movie. It will be good up until the end, and then the way they end this movie off is the biggest spit in your face that they have ever done in life. Okay. It's it's a good it's a good movie overall. But that ending, how it ends is it's a classic move to end that and to end something off when you know you've ridden yourself, not really really ridden yourself in the hole, but ridden characters too great to the point you know you're gonna shed some tears. Mm-hmm. <laughs> okay. So... And it irritates me when they write characters like that. It's good that the character is relatable and I love them. But when you end it like that, you make me hate you ten times more. So, so my my actual last one is is something that I doubt. Well, because me and me and Eternal were talking about this before um, we started. Um, is is it wrong to pick up girls in a dungeon? I am so proud of you. It's such yes. a good show. Yes, yes. That, oh, that's God. honestly my third choice. The little bit of it that I've watched because like I fell off of it for a little bit, um, just because another anime popped up in my mm-hmm. recommended. It's so good. Yeah. So very good. Um, Tyler, did you say any of yours? I only got one. <laughs> and I, I want to be in the, you know, pseudo weep here. Um, I want to be what, in the, the Fates Day Night universe. I was going to say, you're, you're oh, going to be in the Fate verse. Right. I will never want to be in that universe. I'm sorry. I, I will, will never. See, no, Doug. That's too big of a risk. That's, yeah. You got to fight six other people to get the Holy Grail. And if, if you, t- you die, it's all over, dog. If you don't take a risk in life, what are you doing? D- there Full you go. Full circle. See? Full circle, see? 
Uh, but but Eternal, what would yours be? Mine are almost re- very very mainstream, but my hero, mm-hmm. Mm-hmm. Black Clover. Oh yes, and uh, Shield Hero. Knock off Fairy Tale. Let's go. Knock off Fairy Tale. Knock off Fairy Tale. I I'm not, I'm not, I'm sorry. I love Black Clover, but it's so it's so much like a knock off Fairy Tale. It is. It really is. You're not wrong. <laughs> but that's what makes it so good. It's because it's just it's almost like Fairy Tale, but not. And mm-hmm. I love it. Um, I'm waiting for. Is that whole tournament arc over? No. It's still going on? Yeah. What is it? It's been like four months. <laughs> yeah. What the? Oh, I just wanted to be over. I, so I can getting, sit down and watch it. Very, it's getting very close. Okay. Because like, I want to sit down. I've watched like half of it. And I want it to be over so I can sit down and watch the last half of it. Mm-hmm. That's how. That's pretty much how I've done anime now. Is when it comes to certain arcs. Like anime that are like mainstream or coming out with stuff. I'll watch like half of an arc, or I'll watch um, watch it up to a certain arc start. Watch the first episode of that arc so I know when the when it started and stuff like that. And then I'll wait till either it's halfway through or it's finished, and then watch it. Just binge it, yeah, right. yeah. Now, if it's an arc I'm totally invested in, then I'll watch oh, it. I'm, no, I'm sitting down and watching that episode yeah. by episode, hundred yeah. percent. That's what I did recently with. See, and that's what I did with uh, unintentionally with Demon Slayer. Mm-hmm. You know, then again, I I didn't really discover it until I was uh, what guy was it? What was I down there? August, August, the first uh, weekend yeah. of August. Yeah, yeah. Cause yeah. It was, wasn't and, it before the sleepwalk? Yes. No, it was after the. Sleepwalk. No, no, it was after oh, yeah, the sleepwalk. It was after. Yeah. It was a, it was around the time school had classes had started for yeah. everyone. Yep, and because uh, it's like I think I was like I think I was in class for about. A week before our financial aid started to BS me, and then I like saw that you were in Georgia, yeah. Mm-hmm. And it was I, just that whole thing. We all sat down and watched like the first episode. Mm-hmm. I remember we were uh, we were at a bowling alley where I got my behind buttocks thoroughly handed to me, <laughs> um, and we were all watching the opening. And Dylan got hooked on the opening there. He's like, "What's the name of the show?" And we were like, "Yeah, it's Demon Slayer." And he's like, "All right," and now he's hooked on it too. So it's Dude. just like. Oh, everybody's like Frank got hooked on it. I don't know if Ryan was too sold on it. I don't think he's caught up with it yet, but Dude, Frank's caught up with it. Uh, God, everybody loves it. There, it's, it's there's so that could be a topic in itself, but we're almost at two hours here. <laughs> Just mm. the openings. Time flies when you're having fun. Yeah. Yeah. Um, but for the final question is um, kind of just straight to you. What was the main reason that led you to kind of want to be on the podcast? On this one? Yeah. The main reason? What? Yeah. Y'all being cool isn't enough reason? I mean... When you're I right, mean, you're right. I mean... You... <laughs> he said it. Not I me. mean, at the end of the year, we're doing an award show. Yeah. Wait, what? I mean, one of the uh, best guests. Brownie, brownie points and all that. <laughs> Wait, we're doing that? I didn't know we no, were doing no, that. No, <laughs> no, Tyler. Oh. <laughs> <laughs> Where's my best, best third co-host? You're getting me really fucking excited here. <laughs> Tyler's like, wait, where, where's my tertiary co-host? <laughs> where's oh, where's uh, my substitution host award? <laughs> but wait, you've been in every last one, so yeah, you're technically not a three of them. So yeah, Paul Champ. Um. But but is is that just the main reason? I guess. No, uh, one of the main reasons is is it's, it's cool, you know, doing uh doing the Poke Center podcast myself. Yo, go um, go and check out the first three episodes of that. Yeah, the fourth episode was kind of kind of hit a snafu. We're working on that, but I think we're trying to restructure it, mm-hmm. kind of revamp it and make it a little bit more big. Yeah, if that makes sense. Big. Yeah. Bigger than big. Yes. Mm-hmm. Live. Uh, oh, wait. Oh, 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 oh. Okay. Wait a minute. Dude, this man just dropped a bombshell. I did. Yeah. Uh, that's one thing that we're bouncing around. Another thing that we're bouncing around is um, is the timing of it because we mm-hmm. realize we did we started doing it biweekly, mm-hmm. and it became it became more of a uh, 
especially with uh, people like YZ uh, going off on his internship over in Hampshire and stuff like that. Oh, yeah, he's been it telling became, me all about it, Yeah, it, it became a little bit more of a logistics thing. So yeah. now what we're, what we're planning on doing, exclusive, uh, is doing it once a month. But when we do it once a month, we're going to do it live, and we're going to do it for longer. Ooh. Hey. And hopefully we can actually stream it on like YouTube or something so we can actually involve the chat yeah. in the podcast. Oh no, that's possible, yeah. Yeah, no, it's it's gonna be great. And that way, you know, we can get live questions um and things like that too, just to kind of interact. So yeah. it adds another wrinkle to things and it's just it's kind of cool. So okay. I might still by, that idea. by no means is it done. The the first three episodes were probably the three of the most exciting podcast episodes we've ever done yeah so good we all had a great time uh but you know having been on that side of it i i like this side of it too being a guest is awesome yeah i wanted to see you know what it was like just to come in and just uh just hang out i mean uh, we've been here for about two hours <laughs> honestly Tyler. yeah Tyler, uh, take your dms just just talking about pretty much anything um and, and that's one one thing that I love about this is just getting to talk to people uh, more than than I would nor- normally be able to, is, and kind of just I guess what's the word I'm looking for? Kind of just strengthening bonds, I guess. Mm-hmm. Yeah. And that we were so close without a doggo interruption. <laughs> um, but, but yeah. So, jeez, Jerry, you're you're like piercing my ears with that. <laughs> I'm trying to type slow and as quiet as possible. This is not going to happen with this mechanical keyboard. <laughs> um, but yeah. So, with that all being said, we're actually over two hours. <laughs> hey. Um. So, is there any final regards you guys want to talk about? Um. Kind of just closing out. Um, and yeah, just any final words? I love all of you. Oh, that, okay. Tyler, Mystic I want lugs. you to know, all right, I, I'll, I'll say it after the episode, but yeah, guys, thank you guys so much for, uh, for tuning in. Honestly, uh, thanks for just watching, watching the podcast. No, uh, thank you for hosting. Definitely, if you guys have missed the last episode, we did an episode with Krim and Lens Vids, so definitely go check their, uh, their videos out. Yeah. Um, Nick, I will remind Nick to make a playlist for you I guys. I did. Okay, go. <laughs> I, I read your mind. <laughs> um, but I mean, like, with with Krim, it was just all pretty much anime, and, and I loved that. <laughs> mm-hmm. But, um, like with Lens, we, we got deep into it almost immediately, like within the first ten minutes, and that was so great. Um... Yeah, it, it was the heart wrench arc. Yes, <laughs> <laughs> the heart wrench arc of the podcast. Um, but with we had the video, weeb arc, the heart wrench arc. <laughs> the, the I don't know what we're gonna term it. this arc. I don't know what we're terming mm. this arc. The geese arc. The, geese the beast arc. arc. Yeah, the geese. Oh no! Oh my god! The goose. Well, goose. technically, yeah, th- th- this would be the beast arc. The longest part of the podcast. <laughs> Maybe, yeah. Um. But yeah, with all that being said, uh, thank you guys so much for watching. Um, tune in next time. Not sure who our guest is going to be, but I do have a couple of ideas. So hopefully it won't be as long of a wait as this one was because it's been about a month. Yeah, sorry um, about that, guys. Well, yeah. It, it's kind of all three of our faults. So, yeah. Hey, you, you, I have no one to blame but school. I mean. School, always to blame. Um, but yeah, so... This is Extreme Phantom with my friends Eternal, Jerry, er, and Tyler. I almost uh, said Mystic again. Wow, wow. I you swear both, to God. You missed both of it. You missed both <laughs> of the marks. Wow. What, what do you mean? It's like normally you would just say our YouTube names, and then it's like, yeah, not. Nah. Ooh. Hey, Tyler, <laughs> I got something to show you. Okay, okay. but, but let, let me finish. Uh, doing the outro so thank you guys so much for coming out um this is gonna be premiered i know i'm saying this like at the very end of the video 
<laughs> so thank you for everyone who's in the premiere watching it means the world to me and this extreme phantom signing off i'll see you guys next time uh no matter what you're going through your future is bright peace yo peace